Imagine that you've just bought a new phone and you're showing off a photo or cool software or hardware feature to a colleague or friend or random stranger on the street. Now imagine you get distracted for just 30 seconds and in that time the person's able to completely bypass the security settings of your phone and add in their own fingerprint um, so that they can unlock your device at any time in the future without you even knowing. Now this attack takes no pre-planning no scripts or anything like that. It's all done on the device within a matter literally of 30 to 35 seconds. As far as I know, it affects every LG V10 uh, through its fingerprint scanner, although it's entirely possible that other devices are set up in a similar way, possibly even the upcoming LG G5. So let's jump into the tutorial. Now, I don't recommend that you try this on anyone's device. This video is about protecting yourself and I actually will show you a solution to prevent this happening to you in the future without reducing your functionality at all. The only requirement is that Nova Launcher is installed on the phone and based on the popularity of LG's preset launcher, um, I think it's quite common. So typically if you want to add or delete any fingerprints from your V10, you have to go through settings and input a PIN or maybe password. We've all got a lot of apps on our phones and all of these apps come with things called activities, which are basically screens in the apps. So Nova Launcher allows you to access a list of all of these activities for all the apps on your phone. By default, to access this list, all you have to do is press the home button while you're on your home screen and then drag in the activities widget and place it down. It will come up with a list of the activities and simply scroll down find the one that says com.lge.fingerprint settings, hit the drop down and select the first option. As you can see, that produces an icon on the home screen, um, which when tapped allows you to add in a fingerprint immediately and we've bypassed that pin or password screen. As you can see, we can now lock the screen and then completely unlock the device uh, immediately following this. Now there are also several activities for the trusted face unlock setting, although I haven't been able to get that to work in the same way. Basically what it does is it uses the front facing camera to unlock your device. Now if we go back into settings and find the fingerprint section, you'll see that we now have four entries instead of three. That's because we've added one fingerprint. Uh, four is the maximum that you're able to have on the phone. So I thought, hey, what happens now if you tap that um, icon on the home screen? As it turns out, that's the fix for the vulnerability. What you do is add in four fingerprints and you're unable to add in any more. Um, this is what happens when you try to add a fifth fingerprint using the icon. Now using the list of activities through Nova Launcher, you're able to unlock a lot of hidden settings that are usually inaccessible. In particular, I found an app that comes built in with the phone that allows you to change some of the settings on your second screen including unlocking this creepy face. A tutorial for this will be uploaded alongside this video, so check it out now.